Hi, my name is Ndumiso. I'm back again with another video. And this time we're in my preferred door of Cubase. This is Cubase version 10.5 and I've been using it for quite a while. Well, um, in my time using Cubase, I figured out when I was making um, beats that the more stuff I added to the beat, um, I'd get these random audio pops and audio dropouts and they can really, really kill your inspiration. Well, I went hunting on forums and I found the solution to be very simple. So if you are experiencing this issue, the solution is very simple. You go to the studio tab, um, you go right down to the bottom to studio setup you click on the VST audio system and there is a block that you should activate it is called activate Steinberg audio power scheme and once you tick that click apply blah 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 activate blah, 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 blah. say okay go okay and there you go immediately you can see a difference in the processing load and um, that's what helped me I haven't experienced any audio dropouts or pops ever since you would think something like this would be on by default but mm, let's not go there but anyway no more audio dropouts and pops for me when using cubase and i hope this tip is helpful for you as well if you like this video do leave a like and subscribe my name is Dumiso. catch you on the next video